What's up everyone? This is Sincerely Maria, your number one channel for self-care, self-love, and self-resilience. Today's topic of discussion will be how to always look put together. Now, obviously this does not mean 24 seven because if you're like me and you're at home, you want to be as relaxed as possible and not care one bit about what you look like. This is for every other occasion. So let's get started on how to always look put together. Let me ask you this. What is the first thing people see when they look at you? Your face. When you are trying to look well put together all or most of the time, make sure you've put in a little bit of effort on your money maker face. This does not mean you need to put on a ton of makeup, but it just means to make sure you've wash your face in the morning, you've moisturized, and if you absolutely need to or want to, you have minimal makeup on. I have the worst dark circles genetically, so I swipe on some concealer anytime I walk out the door. This is just an essential for me when I want to look presentable and not put in too much of an effort. I think it's very important also to have a regular skincare routine. This does not have to be anything overly complicated, but something simple but very effective. For example, exfoliating. Exfoliating should be a must just to remove dead skins off your face. Another area you should focus on is your hair. Just like your face, your hair is a primary attraction point when people first look at you. This again does not mean you need to spend an hour of your day trying to do your hair. No one has time for that. It just means to always have your hair clean and brushed out. That gives it a neat look which helps you overall look put together. Whether that's let down, curly, or just in a messy bun, just make sure it looks intentional. Next thing when it comes to looking presentable is focusing on your clothes. This does not mean you need to spend hours deciding what to wear or spend a lot of money buying new clothes. You can work with what you already have in your closet. When you are trying to look presentable all the time, make sure the clothes you are wearing are clean and they are ironed. Always, always, always make sure your clothes are ironed. I don't know how many people I see wearing really nice clothes that are not ironed and because of that, the person just does not look well put together or polished. Also, when it comes to your clothes, make sure you have a dress code. This means when you are going to work, um, have a set of work clothes that you only wear at work. When you are going out with your friends, have a set of casual clothes for when you see your friends. If you are going on a date or a party, have a set dress code for those type of days. People who look presentable all the time know how to dress for each occasion. You don't want to show up at work with your casual clothes on, just like you shouldn't be going to see your friends in your workout clothes. Please don't wear your casual clothes to work. Pick out something more work related, whether your company wants you to dress more professional or not. By setting a dress code for yourself, you will always look well put together and presentable because you are dressed for the occasion. Moving on to the next. Pay attention to the details. This is something a lot of us miss, including myself, but I'm working on it. If you want to look presentable all, if not most of the time, then you need to pay attention to the little details. This means making sure your nails are trimmed and clean, or if you have your nails done, they are fresh and not chipping. If you don't do your nails, just make sure your cuticles are clean and you have maybe just a clear coat on to add some shine to your natural nails. When it comes to your shoes, make sure they are clean and they don't have mud all over them from yesterday's rain. Try to clean your shoes monthly if possible to make them always look clean and new. What about accessories? The smallest accessory can have the biggest impact. For instance, putting on a stud of earrings all of a sudden makes you look more put together. Or wearing a watch or adding a cute little necklace to your outfit really emphasizes your look and makes you appear more presentable. If you are like me, very lazy when it comes to accessories, then do what I do. I have a few statement pieces 
that are my go-to jewelry. For example, my watch. I think maybe I only own two watches and I switch between them depending on the occasion. I don't like wearing earrings because I feel like they're so uncomfortable. So I have a pair of stud earrings that I wear almost any time I want to look more presentable. As you can see, the smallest things make the biggest impact on your look. So make sure to accessorize and find simple go-to pieces if you're trying to look presentable all the time. So far, we have talked about the importance of your face, hair, clothing, and accessories. Now, let's focus a little bit on you yourself. The next thing that is very important in helping you look more put together is your posture and mannerism. If you do everything we just talked about, fresh face, nice hair, clean, wrinkle-free clothing, and cute accessories, but your posture is not straight and you slouch all the time, then unfortunately everything else you're doing is just not helping you look put together. So I cannot emphasize how important it is to stand straight or sit straight, put your shoulders back and your chin up to look more presentable. By doing this, you are carrying yourself much better, which automatically makes you look so much more polished and well put together. Obviously, if you are hanging out with your friend at home, watching TV, you don't need to be focusing on looking perfect. But when you are out in public, having dinner, or just grabbing a bite to eat, then look at the way you fold your legs or the way that you place your hands. And again, pay attention to your posture. If you are finding that you are all over the place and not sitting and standing straight, then you start looking less put together. Try to work on those a bit. Along with this, your mannerism counts a lot. If you are messy with the way that you eat or you're dragging your legs when you walk, then that makes a very big difference on your appearance. Look at yourself in the mirror and see if you need to adjust a little. Ask someone close to you if you're a messy eater. If they say yes, then clean up your eating manners. By correcting your posture and polishing your mannerism, you start looking much more put together. I hope you found this video valuable and now you know how to look more well put together, most if not all the time. Let me know if you try out some of these tips and how they work out for you. I would love to know. This channel is all about being the best version of yourself and living your best life. By looking presentable all the time, you are bringing your best foot forward no matter where you are or what you are doing. I just want to remind you that life is short, it's a blessing, so please make sure you take advantage of every single day. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe down below and also make sure you check out these videos I will link below. I am sure you will find them very helpful. Until next time, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye.